So I was in Afghanistan, 2009-2010, uh, uh, going on my basically like last mission that I was there. We were just doing a routine patrol, and uh, I was second vehicle in the patrol. My front vehicle, the front vehicle went right. I went left. As soon as we went left, IED blast went off. Um, when it went off, I, I, it knocked me out, and then I woke back up. Uh, and first thought was I thought we were in a vehicle rollover, and because uh, we were just in near some ravines and stuff like that. Uh, finally started realizing, you know, we were hit by an IED. Well, I was at a point, and it wasn't PTSD. It was I was so up on narcotics and stuff like that that I would sit in the house and play video games and uh, just couldn't do, just didn't want to do nothing. And it wasn't because I was, I was sad about it. It's just that I was in so much pain that I couldn't, you know. And uh, I told a story a while back, you know, that what changed me was. I was at Disneyland with my daughter and my wife and I couldn't walk very far. Couldn't do nothing, couldn't, couldn't enjoy myself. And it wasn't because, uh, you know, I'm an appetite or whatever, it's because I was that guy is sitting around not doing shit, you know, feeding off the drugs you know, that, that they gave me. And so I, I basically was like, fuck this, you know, I'm done. Like, I'm gonna get myself in shape. There's people running marathons that are missing legs. I can get in there and lift some iron, you know? And so that's when it started for me. That's when the journey started for me. and. Uh, and uh, as I got around certain like guys like you and you know uh, other people you know in the gym that just inspired me you know what I mean and to uh, and to lift and just enjoy it and just you know and you f you forget about all that shit it's gone you know because this this is my life now you know what I'm saying and, and I enjoy it and I'm having fun it's like it's in here and we're in here deadlifting and shit right I'm fucking still bleeding you know I mean like that like what's not what's not uh, enjoyable about life like how can you not be happy I mean you're fucking alive you may be missing some body parts you may have seen some gnarly ass shit but you're fucking alive and you got family and you got, you know, friends. And so like, I always try to talk to these kids, you know, that are, you know, whether in military or they've had some type of um, intense life situation to where it's kind of mentally messed them up. And the key is I've always told people just, just not, I don't want to, you can't just get over it, but help yourself get over it. Like push yourself, find something or get with some people that will um, help you stop thinking about it you know what I mean and so I, I I've always been like that and I and I know like PTSD it's a touchy subject you know it's very touchy but um, I feel like you know most people could probably if they find something that they can just enjoy life with and just move on you know they can get past that you know and so that's what I've done with the, the fitness industry you know and and uh, and I've enjoyed it and I, I don't look back and I have no regrets